Hello there. Today we're going to have a look at what is often known as the guessometer, which displays your range here in the center of the display. Now, many electric cars have these and they all work in pretty much the same way. Now, these uh, devices show your remaining percentage in, in uh, the battery, which is a constant, always a constant. Uh, that is how much you actually have left. And they also show uh, often a guess of the miles remaining uh, to go. Now, that is not a constant. That varies depending on how you've been driving in the past, how you're driving now, and whether you've got any demands on. For example, if you look at this uh, display, it says 184 miles, but if I put the demister on, it drops by eight miles. Now, if I had the fan on this hard for an hour long journey, I'd use far more than eight miles worth of range. Eight miles is only a couple of kilowatt hours. I'm sure that an hour's driving, I'd use more than that. Let's turn that off again. Now, a lot of people get very upset when their advertised range is uh, a lot higher than the actual range shown in the car. But you'd be much more upset if you suddenly ran out of power at 50 miles before you were expecting to. So this can only show you how much range it thinks you're going to have left. The true accurate representation is the percentage. Um, on the MG4, uh, if you're in a panic about what you're being shown here, you can always reset. Now this display here is based on your um, accumulated total, which is not a very high, particularly high uh, miles per kilowatt hour. So you can always reset that uh, by holding down this button on the steering wheel. And all of a sudden we now have 199 miles range. Now nothing's actually changed. Uh, the battery hasn't suddenly gained a lot of range. What it has done is it's reset the percentage available versus what it thinks it will be able to do per mile. Now, the average range calculation is based on a consumption of 3.7 miles per kilowatt hour. So if you're in the summer, you'll probably be doing far more than uh, than this kind of distance per per 80 percent. So we're looking at what we're looking at 20 miles per 10 percent, 240 miles range um, at 3.7 miles per kilowatt hour. You're looking at far more. You could easily achieve 300 miles in gentle driving in the summer. Uh, in the winter, obviously, as I start driving again, the average will drop below 3.7 and this figure will start to drop as well. If you'd like to see some tips on how to maximise your car's efficiency in cold weather, please click on the link above. So don't worry, your car isn't dying, your battery isn't dead or, or about to expire on you permanently. It's just winter and the cold and the fact that your car is far less efficient in cold weather.